Good afternoon guys, welcome to today's vlog. Uh, finished work now and I'm heading to somebody's house. Uh, not in that type of way. Uh, I'm buying something of somebody from on Facebook. Um, a storage solution for the flat, so, so yeah. All sorted guys, I've got the thing in the back there, the little, I don't know if you can see it, I'm filming on my work phone, it's the iPhone 7 Plus, it's not the best camera, uh, my phone is using Apple CarPlay, so so yeah, just got that, as you can see got some balloons in the back as well, that's Hannah's, uh, not Hannah's, that's Chloe's, because it's Chloe's birthday, um, Chloe's birthday is tomorrow, she is 18, would you believe it, I cannot believe it myself. Yeah, Chloe's birthday. So, yep, she's gonna be having them tonight as well. We're heading around there this evening um, for that. But before we do that, we've got to go home and do the cupboard and get get the little shelfy thing in the cupboard. So, so yeah, I'll see you guys in a sec when I get home. Home now, guys. I've got the unit here. This is basically what it is. Yep, it's just a unit. It's a uh, it's plastic. It's white. It all pops apart, so I can take things off and whatnot. And I paid four pound for it. This is going to go in the bedroom. It's actually meant for like bathrooms and I think. Um, but the plan of it is, is I want it to go and sit in there. It's going to sit nicely. It fits perfectly actually in there. Giving me some shelving, giving me more storage. This is the current setup. Like I've got basically just everything just chucked here. So I need to get all this out um, and then I'm gonna start. Then I can start actually putting it in and um, yeah, making it what I want it to be, I suppose. So just chuck all this out for now. I'll have to find a new home for all this. I don't know where this is gonna go. Never actually thought of that. It's always the same though, whenever you're like doing something for like your flat or whatever. Um, yeah, I might actually, I'm actually going to, I'm gonna take these off the like the top because I don't really need them. Um, and it's a perfect height. Um, if anything, it's probably too high, um, but I can also take out these things. That's really good. I can take these out if it's too high, um, if I want to, so. Yeah, let's just see what this looks like. So here we go then, let's just try and lift this up and in. And um, yeah, as you can see, it's hitting the clothes, which is fine for now. Put that in there. Oh, look at that, that looks perfect. It fits perfectly. I've got some shelving. Yeah, really, really happy with that. Really, really impressed. I might take the feet out maybe and just have that as the bottom. Yeah, I think I'll do that. All these things are literally just trial and error. Like you've just got to do stuff and um, and just get the output you want, I suppose. So yeah, I can take the cap off, put them on the bottom then uh, for feet. We're doing good. Put this on there. The final one, let's just get that cap in there. There we go. There we go. We're all in. So that is the bottom. Then this is the top. Let's try again. Hopefully now we won't be hitting it. Yeah, perfect fit. Absolute perfect fit. Look at that. Really impressed with that. Like really, really impressed. Um, I want to use it for like shorts and t-shirts that I just, around the flat. So like a pair of shorts just to be chucked on there nicely. Obviously all folded and stuff. But yeah, that is awesome. Really like that. So the rest of the bits, I'm probably just going to chuck them out because I'm never going to use these again. I don't know. Keep them for now just in case. But yes, awesome. Everything in there basically is going to go in there. Now there's not a lot in there at all. It's a very, very small unit and I do want to uh, get rid of that. So that's up for sale. The desk is up for sale yet to go. That's going to go up for sale, but it's not going to go yet. We just have a lot of sorting out to do. And before long, guys, this whole area, the new desk is going to be awesome. And we're going to have a very minimal desk setup and also a video coming soon. That is why I've held off doing the desk setup in the flat because it's gonna change. I always knew I was gonna have a new desk when I moved in, I just didn't know actually when. Um, sorry, just taking my jacket off. But yeah, I knew I was gonna have a new desk eventually. That's starting to take reality now. We've obviously done the kitchen um, in there. We've got the new table, as you can see. It's all coming together in the flat now. Once we've done that, the next stage then is to move the bookshelf, which is behind the pillar for you guys, there. That's gonna be moved. And we're getting new settees, believe it or not, we're getting new sofas in the flat. Um, we're actually having my mum's old ones. Um, yeah, we, it's a lot better quality than what we got now. It's also a lot bigger than what we got now, um, but they're better settees. So for the long term for me and Hannah, because obviously the flat's not long term, um, we're gonna be having that. So it's all exciting, I'm very excited. Tonight though, me and Hannah are going to uh, my mum's uh, to see my sister, because would you believe it, she is, 18 years of age, would you believe it? So um, yeah, we've got some presents and stuff that I've got to wrap now and a card 
and yep yeah, pop the fizz and all that stuff so i mean i can put all this on now because this video is going to go up after my sister's birthday actually by the time you guys are seeing this hopefully it's saturday um because the apple watch will be here which yeah, it's all gonna be exciting. So I need to put that together. I need to put her presents together and wrap her presents. Also got a, a bottle of peach snaps because she's like obsessed with it. And um, yeah, her main present is a Morphe makeup palette. 350M Nature Glow Matte. I know nothing about it, but yeah. So yeah, that's what I wanted to do in, in this little start of the vlog because I basically uh, just went to get that little unit and now I'm putting presents, uh, wrapping presents and stuff. And then I'm heading to my mum. So I'm family evening. So yeah, I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow where it's Apple Watch launch day. So yeah, come on. The next day. Good afternoon guys, it's the day after now. Yesterday we had a really, really good evening with Chloe, fantastic times. Yeah, it was good. She's 18 today. This is her 18th birthday today. Mental, absolutely mental. However, today we have got the Apple Watch. And um, you guys by now would have seen this, my unboxing video. I'm gonna be filming an unboxing video very, very much right away. But first I need to tidy up this uh, because I'm gonna be filming it in the kitchen uh, today. Try and do something different. Uh, I wanna use the white kitchen table really as well. So I think it'll look really good on this. So gonna try and set everything up now and um, yeah, get myself sorted for the unboxing. I'm very excited. I haven't opened it yet. Haven't opened it. I'm just like, oh, I'm dying too. But I was in, it, was, it literally came first thing in work at nine o'clock. And, um, and yeah, it was just sat on my desk for like three hours because I couldn't leave until 12 because I had half day. So yeah, it was so, so painful to just sit there with it. But um, it's gonna be worth it. I'm excited to, um, to be able to play with it today and have a look at it and um, unbox it for you. I've never unboxed an Apple Watch on camera because I actually had my Apple Watch before I started doing YouTube. That's how old my Apple Watch was. Like I feel like I've been doing YouTube forever. Like I couldn't imagine my life now without a YouTube channel. And um, yeah, so this is exciting for me for multiple reasons, not just the fact of that. But um, yeah, let's just get everything sorted. Let's get the flat looking good for the, for the, for the set. And yeah, I'm so excited. Looking good now guys, I've got the main camera uh, just there and then I've got my phone over there. We're gonna unbox, this is exciting. Let's do this. Just like that, a boxing video finished. I cannot wait to play with my new watch. So there it is guys, for you guys on the vlog now, I'm going to be um, setting up the Apple Watch. It's, um, yeah, the first time. So this is how the Apple Watch looks. Let's just wait for it to focus. Focus, focus. Come on. So there we go. As you can see, we've got the aluminium edition here. It looks really, really cool. I haven't yet paid it, but there's the back. Look at that. That looks amazing. A ceramic back. It looks really, really nice. Yeah, really impressed with the design. Very, very happy. If you guys missed the unboxing video, please go back and watch that a few days ago. I'm filming like two videos at once right now. It is absolutely crazy to my mind. However, we need to pair my Apple Watch to my phone. I haven't yet done it. Um, because I was using my phone to film a segment for the unboxing video, so head over there and watch it. Um, but now we need to go into the Apple Watch app and um, we need to start pairing. So you just press a little button there, start pairing, uh, and then you hold your camera over the Apple Watch. So you do it like this. So here is the Apple Watch itself, um, as you can see. Now I'm just gonna hold my phone over it, um, align it up properly, and there we go. Your Apple Watch is paid happy days so i'm actually gonna restore it from a backup from my old watch um i've got like loads of backups on here for some reason i'm back from 2015 but i'm actually going to install it from this one although i'm not sure i'm not sure if this is actually going to work because this watch is on watch OS 5 whereas my previous apple watch was on watch os 4 so we'll see hopefully it works because then all my activity stuff is just going to go over that's basically the main thing i want to Restore from the backup. However, yes, very impressed with this design though. It looks really, really nice. Let's just take off the old cheapy watch, the analog one, which I've worn for the last week of time because, yeah, not having my main Apple Watch, well, my, my Apple Watch has really had a dampener on me because, 
yeah, I've really missed it. So let's just put the Apple Watch on now, the new um, sport model I've got. Obviously joining the gym now, got myself a sport model. Um, yeah, so okay, so it says on the Apple Watch, please continue um, on the iPhone. So shared settings, so Apple Watch. Okay, so let's just go straight into this, guys. We're gonna just try and set it up. It says continue on your phone. So shared settings, so Apple Watch shares data from your iPhone, so okay. Um, create a passcode, yeah, I'll just do that on the Apple Watch itself. Um, so heart health, Apple Watch can help you look after your heart. Um, Apple Pay, I will continue that as well. Emergency SOS, uh, and now my Apple Watch is going to sync. So you've got like a new little thing on here. Oh, this is actually the first time I'm using the new crown. So let's take a look at this. So we've got a sync in there in the background, but we've got this new uh, digital crown here, which is um, actually um, haptic feedback, very much like the iPhone. We've got the new digital crown here, which is haptic feedback. So yeah, this is a new thing as well, whenever you're setting up an Apple Watch. Obviously I set mine up in 2015 um, last. So here we go, it says Apple Watch the basics. So you can like go in, quickly use, it tells you how to use different things. So you can swipe back and forth. Um, and then also you've got the digital crown. It tells you how to use it. Press the digital crown to hold hold in. It will launch Siri and yeah, turn it to scroll, which obviously you, you've done here. But yeah, very, very impressed. Um, and then you've got the side button. It tells you how to use that. Press that to show the dock. Swipe across, double click to pay Apple Pay, which we know, and then press and hold uh, for medical ID. So yeah, very good. You've got a little text there as well to say, I've done the Apple Watch basics. Will I get a medal for that? I don't know. But yeah, all in all, guys, while this is setting up now, I'm just gonna, um, yeah, sort myself, sort this out. It's got a sync and stuff. It's in the middle of syncing all the data across and stuff. But yeah, I will let you know my immediate thoughts on it. I'm very impressed with the new design um, as well. Like the back really impresses me. Like that is really, really nice looking. But um, yeah, very, very, very happy with it so far. So yes. While this is syncing though, I'm actually gonna start editing my unboxing video because I wanna get that up as soon as possible. It's launch day today, so I'm actually just gonna sit here and um, yeah, upload the video that I filmed earlier. And yeah, it's, it's, it's all happening. It's all happening. Apple Watch is out. Very happy. So there we go guys, I've got my unboxing video all up. I am very, very happy. Also, while that was doing that, I also managed to, uh, as you can see, set my Apple Watch up, we're all ready to go. Everything is working awesome and I really, really am impressed um, with it. So I can quickly show you there, that will just quickly show you guys exactly how big the screen is as you can see there that was a holiday I went on a few years ago um, and yeah look there's the bezels that is how big the screen is so you've got multiple different watch faces here so you can slide through them and change your watch face as you would normally as you can see there um, got some more there there's just a standard one it just looks really really cool oh it's telling me to do stuff stand I'm too busy but if I go all the way to the new face this is the new one it's called infograph um, you can have up to nine complications on there, and that's the one that Apple's using in all their marketing. Um, I really, really like this face. It looks, it looks really, really cool. Um, obviously, then you've got um, your um, control center, which is really, really advanced. Um, new for this model, well, not for this model. New for the model, uh, the Series Two. I only had the Series Zero, which is the first model, but it actually has swimming capabilities now. So I'm very excited to try that out soon. Um, also on the back then as you can see we've got the um, the ceramic back. It's made of ceramic. It looks really really nice I'm, I'm just in awe of it. I really am. It's a really really nice product um, and You can see there's a little different color there on the crown uh, just at the top uh, That is the ECG which is not available in the UK right now But it will be coming out very very soon um, in America. It's not out at launch either um, So that's gonna be coming coming soon probably to the UK um, once they just get it all uh, approved and stuff by health boards. But yeah, I'm wearing my Apple Watch now for the day. I've been missing it. Um, I literally have been missing it. Like obviously just wearing a standard um, watch here. This has been not so much a nightmare. Like it's been fine wearing this. Um, but I have missed the, the ease of notifications. And I've had to have my phone on like vibrate and stuff. Because I never normally do like. But I, I can't miss um, calls and texts and stuff. Whereas with with this I don't need my phone on vibrate. So so yeah, there's just a few little little things really, you know, that, that I like with it, without having it. But obviously joining the gym now, I'm very excited to be testing this out, swimming, everything. Um, and yeah, I've also got a ton of bands 
uh, from the previous one and all the bands from the older 42 and 38 model will work with the 44 and the 40 model respectively. That is because the size isn't um, width, it is height. So the width has stayed the same, um, but the height of the Apple Watch is gained by two millimeters. And to be honest with you, I can't really notice a difference in terms of uh, it being bigger than my previous one. Um, it's a little bit thicker than my previous one, but it's thinner than the Series 3. Um, because like I said, I had the first Apple Watch. So so yeah, Apple Watch obtained, very happy, all set up, everything's awesome. This evening now is Chloe's birthday. Let's just get back on the vlog. Let's Apple Watch, let's just turn the Apple Watch off. Well, not turn off, but you know what I mean? Let's just not talk about it. And yeah, so today is Chloe's birthday. Yesterday we went around there um, uh, and gave her a present and stuff. We actually bought her a Morphe makeup palette with um, a bottle of peach snaps because she's 18. My sister, my little sister is 18. It's absolutely insane. So happy birthday to Chloe, if you're watching. Um, sorry you're not in the Thailand thumbnail because Apple Watch has taken over. Um, yeah, hey ho. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna like get on with some stuff around the flat because we are heading to a party there uh, later on. It's obviously her birthday, 18. She's having a birthday party. I am not taking you guys with me because I want to enjoy, I want to drink, and I'm gonna be with people that don't even know I do YouTube. So it's gonna be awkward. So. Yes. So I've got to wait for Hannah to come in. Um, while I'm doing that, I'm just gonna like go through some YouTube stuff. I've also got um, a donut here um, from work. Somebody, like a client of ours, came in and bought Krispy Kreme, and so I decided to pick one up. Look, there it is. So I'm gonna eat this now. Um, sit here, and I'm gonna. I've got another vlog to edit, um, which is gonna go up today as well. I'm gonna upload two videos today. Um, so I'm gonna edit that before, obviously, I get ready and go. And mm, yeah, just gonna take it easy. Just gonna take it easy. Got a new Apple Watch, half day work, so.